My God, you love stroking the beard, don't you? I love to stroke it in public, too. Meow, meow. Just like this. Just, oh. <laughs> anyway, so amazing. <laughs> Sometimes I stare people in the eyes as I do it. <laughs> no one's gonna post on. I'm gonna post a video. I don't. I don't care actually. So today it's a beautiful Saturday. We should be outside, but we are nerds, so we're staying inside to play with plastic army men. Yeah. So Mason, what is today's army men mission? So at two thousand points today, mm -hmm. uh, we are doing Eternal War Strike Force, the Four Pillars. Uh, so, reinforcement units cannot be set up within range of objective markers. There's four, uh, up. There are four objectives. One in basically in each table corner. There's a 9-inch no-man's zone in the center. And, of course, there's take and hold, which is progressive. Control 1, control 2, control more. Pretty standard. Mm -hmm. And do you want to do secondary objectives today or no? Nah. Okay. So, we're... We're not going to worry about who dies the most. We're not going to worry about uh, like psychic actions that I might do with my Grey Knights here. What do you do? Yep. Let's be honest. Yeah, yeah it's Grey Knights. So we're not going to worry about any of that. We're only looking at primary objectives, and that's it. All right. So that'll be the. So that's the mission today. Can you describe your force? You know what, this is why we have technology that works sometimes. So, as you can see in the title, I got the guard. I got my infamous Flaukhoof guard that was trained by the Canadians. So, uh, starting off, my warlord is a company commander. He's got a plasma pistol, power fist, because he likes to fist things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, he... I stroke them. <laughs> Anywho, um, <laughs> threw me off right there. <laughs> I'm horrified. Okay, so he has... <laughs> he has... The... God dang it, Mason. Get your mind out of the gutter. No, it's... Mm, okay, so... He's got the um, Aquila as, as a relic. So that so on a 5 up doing your turn, I get a command point. Then my World of Trait... Is the one that actually in my in my um, turn I actually get a command point back on a on a five up. Yep. No. So. There's still the limitation of one command point per turn, and that's it. Yes. So now for the fun, I have command and pass. He's gonna be riding in a lumen rust with heavy bolters, lots cannon, heavy sub track guards, and make this fun. I'm gonna do a hundred killer rocket also. Then, as an LA tank commander, it's a Luminous Demolifer, Laws Cannon, Plasma Cannons, Heavy Stub, uh, Hunter Killer Rocket, and Track Guards. Yes. And all Battle Cannons, I assume, right? No, Demolifer Cannon. Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, then I have four infantry squads, all have grenade launchers, one of them has a, has a rocket launcher. Nice and easy. I have an officer with a fleet, a special weapon squad with three melter guns, two tech priests, then I have a armor sentinel with a multi-laser. Then I got two heavy motor batteries that has uh, three heavy motors in it. Mm. So no. six. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty good. Um, then another demolisher, same loadout as the other as the other demolisher. Four chimeras, heavy sub, heavy bolter, multi-laser, and track guards. Then in a separate detachment, I'm running with. Three assassins, which is a Venicator, a Calexis, and a what's the name of the spooky guy? <laughs> that is the Calidus. That's what I said. I'm saying the spooky one, as in the anti psycho one. Oh, that is a Calexis. Now my question is, am I gonna bleep that out? No. No. <laughs> no, we're very not PC in this channel, so. <laughs> Um, <laughs> and making, the bands just get rolling in. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna make an order of that. Okay. Anywho, <laughs> that's my army. That's two K on the dot. Mason, what's um, yours? Also two K on the dot. Green knights. 
for my HQs, I am trying out a brother captain for the first time, and I can't remember how long now. I think it's been since like 6th edition since I've used one of them. Uh, let's see, the captain has warp shaping. There's a Fury of Deimos, which is basically the cross between a storm bolter and a heavy bolter. Okay. Uh, and he's got a enormous Nemesis Force Halberd, a librarian. He's got Demon Slayer, Purifying Flame, Vortex of Doom. Uh, his Warlord trait is Psychic Epitome, Artisan Nullfire Matrix, which is basically an aura of nobody here can perils. And he is Exemplar of the Silver Host. Uh, make sure I don't, didn't miss anything. Yep, okay. Oh, wait, he has the Gem of Vinactu, which is a once per game plus two to your Psychic Rolls. I have three regular Terminator squads. All of them have Psy Cannons. One of them has a uh, Just Car with a Demon Hammer. And I have a regular Strike Squad, 10 man, that is uh, Nemesis Falchions. And I still have them on the 25 mil basis, so they'll be pretty easy to spot. I have a 10 man Interceptor Squad, all with Halberds. And I have, oh yes. The Grandmaster and Nemesis Dread Knight, he has Gate of Infinity, he has First of the Fray, which is, I paid a CP point for that. Uh, he has Heavy Incinerator, Heavy Psy Cannon, Nemesis Greatsword, and Shield of Humanity, which basically grants him the extra stuff. And then I have two regular Nemesis Dread Knights, these both have the Hammers. These both have Psy Cannons, and one has a Silencer, the other has an Incinerator. Well, Gatling Silencer and Heavy Incinerator. You get yeah. their versions. I have not had good luck with Nemesis, Nemesis Great Hammers or Demon Hammers hitting. Let's see if I can change that around this time around. <laughs> Is that it? Yes. I think I'll, I think I understand. All, my mind is still reeling of what they just said. <laughs> oh, about the hmm and the hmm. 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 No. Anyway, so no. <laughs> let's move on with the first turn. <laughs> okay, so we did quite a bit of movement this time around. The dice that you see next to the units are for ones that had advanced and how far they advanced. The intercessor here, his base is basically on the edge, but we just put him like that to make it easier for the moment. So, the only things that I've done so far for a psychic was, uh, oh, somehow I'm having a brain fart. Game of Infinity. Thank you. Gave Infinity from the Grandmaster for the Dread Knight that was over here that went boop. Because now he has smite range. They have smite range. And then these guys also have, of course, because they, they have range to him with both smite and shooting weapons, but their storm bolters probably won't do much. I mean, we're only on a six up. Yep, but you know what? It's something, right? Yeah, they never know. I mean, even these guys, I can, pro I can shoot a little bit over, but... And they won't do much. But I can try, right? Mm-hmm. So, first things first, double check. Yep, that's more than good enough on that guy and that guy. So just these these front two mm -hmm. can hit him. And I don't think anybody really has lance at him, so no. But if they can hit him, they can also hit him. Mm -hmm. So I'll decide here in a little bit. First is smiting. I'll do eh, now I'll do his smite over there first against the sentinel. Okay. So I'll bring that over to you. Smite going off on a five. Put my hand there. That fails. And the smite with the interceptors against the tank. That one goes off. And it went off on a nine. So D3, and yeah, just one, mm. just one mortal wound. Not that bad. 
And that is my psychic phase. And then let's start shooting people, shall we? Mm-hmm. Now we're going to the Dread Knight right there. Now he will start shooting with first the heavy Psy Cannon. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, put that over there for the moment. Yep. From what to what? The Nemesis Dread Knight. Okay. There against your Sentinel. Okay. And the, uh, you know what, the Heavy Incinerator will go against the same target. Okay. Why not? Heavy Psy Cannon, he hits on threes right now. All, All hits. hits. Yep. And Strength eight. So threes. Threes. So four of them. And minus, minus two, two damage apiece. So we go five. Look at that. Only two points of damage. All right. Lucky and, me, right? Yep. Oh, and for anybody who, before we forget, at my command phase, I put this dice as a marker down here for the orbital bombardment or silence bombardment. At the start of my next command phase, anything that's within six inches of this marker here, I'm going to roll a d6 for, and we'll see how many mortal wounds they take. Minus one if they're a character, plus one if they're within three. On a two to a five, they suffer d3. On a six plus, they suffer d6 mortal wounds. But we'll see how many of those guys move on Brett's movement phase. We'll see how much he actually moves. A lot like half my army. <laughs> we'll see about that. Uh, let's see, so that part is done. Now I need the 2d6 shots for the heavy incinerator. Okay. Yep, 2d6. Wow. Okay. Two, four, six. And eight. what's the uh, um, strength on this? 9, 10, 11, 12. This is just going to be strength 6. Okay, so 4 is up to 1. Yep. AP is minus Ooh. 1. Wow. 4 is up, you said, right? Yes. Uh, yeah, that was uh, less than Math Hammer. <laughs> well, hold on one quick second. Let me go double check the stats, okay? Yeah. Okay, so these are ignored. These are AP minus one. Okay, so four is up. One damage per. So I took three, they said how many points per? One, and okay. it's AP minus one. So that's probably gonna be a fail too. No, it's three up safe. Oh, it's three up. I thought there were four. Or is that the, the other one? Scout. Okay. So four up. So that's an additional three. Yep, so. So you took I have one from the smite, three from that. I have one wound left. Okay, and you took two from the yep. heavy second. Yep. Okay. In that case, oh, I'm my phone. Um, let's see, heavy incinerator from here will be out of range. Mm-hmm. But let's put the uh, Gatling silencer into. You know, it's probably not going to do a whole lot against your Chimera, but I'll have it finish off the Sentinel. Okay. At least try to. Okay. And that is my Grandmaster, so he will be able to hit a little bit better. And I'm doing this just double check. Yes, okay. So I need 12 shots from the get-go. He is hitting on twos right now, and this is the only stat that actually changes on him. Okay. Strength? Strength is 5, AP minus 1. Okay, so And because I have the Brother Captain over here... Mm-hmm. I'm re-rolling ones to wound. Got it. Which I don't have any ones to wound. But let's see, it's strength five against toughness six, right? Yes. So I think that's all you have at minus one. Oh, he dead. Does he go boom or does he not do that? He does he usually does go boom, but only on six. Okay. So he's dead. Oh no, 35 points wasted. Eh. I tried something, right? You did, yeah. Okay, in that case, next up, let's see. I'll get the Terminators going here. Okay, and these are from what to what? These these two that can see him. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry. They advance. They can't do that. I'm sorry. Yay. Uh, so these guys here, mm -hmm. they will all shoot their Storm Bolters mm -hmm. into him. Okay. Now, I will roll this twice. Okay. 
because this is 12 dice. I have all those other ones sorted for something else. Okay. So first off, and are they within range of, where's that tape measure real quick? Boop. Nope, I didn't think so, but I tried. Okay. Do they have ants? Uh, these guys did not. Okay. Doop, doop. So those hits, and the score six is to wound. I get one. Okay. One AP zero. I'm good. I figured. I tried. And the Dread Knight over here, mm -hmm. he's going to put both of his weapon, shooting weapons into that Lehman Ross. Okay, and what weapon is that? On that? Heavy uh, Psy Cannon and okay. Gatling Silencer. Okay. So, Heavy Psy Cannon first. Let's see, all hits. And Strength 8. So I need 4s, right? Yes. These will be AP minus two. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pop that one flare jump off, give me a um, cover save. Okay, is that minus one or two point, command points? It's, my, it's one command point. One command point, yeah. okay. So it will be a... Let me get that for you real quick over here. Oh, let's see if I even get the command point back. <laughs> I do. Okay, so it costs you nothing. Uh, so it will be a four up save. Okay. Oh, look at that. Save me from one. So how many? Two how many? damage. Two? Okay. I'll need that dice for the other part. Yes. And I'm going to just move this. Da, 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 da. Oh, no, not six. No, 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 no. All right. And then the Gatling silencer. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm not in range of any kind of rerolls, so strength five. One, two, three, four. And then AP minus one? Yep, one. AP minus one, one damage. Uh, I'll take one wound. Yep, okay. It's shipping at you. Thank God for a tech priest. Yep. And then, uh, let's see. Why not? I'll see if I can do a charge. Uh, do you want to cut that for... TikTok, or you want to keep rolling? No, we keep on rolling for TikTok. By the way, Dyson Brushes, we are at. Um, we do it at the end of each turn, not phase anymore. All right, so he's just over nine inches away from your Chimera there. Okay. So technically, plus the one inch forgiveness, so I would need to roll it. I need to roll a nine or better. My question is this because of the terrain itself, is that a difficult mm -hmm. terrain? Not for this. Now, if it feels like pipes or something that we, he would have to go over, then yeah. Big old rocks. <laughs> Let's see. It fails anyway. Thank God. So, nope. Um, do I want to spend that command point? Not really. Not yet. That's later. I'll save that. All right. And that'll conclude my turn because I don't think you have any morale to take. No, I do not. Okay. Take two. Yes, so we had a complete mess up on something because I forgot some rules that Mason actually remind me of. Tie to shadows for these guys because they're more than 12 inches away. They are both in light and heavy, or sorry, not heavy, dense terrain from the mortars. So they will plus one armor and minus one to hit. <laughs> That's what we forgot. But uh, yes. go ahead and go back to your orders. Uh, yes. So, right here, I had, I did, because um, he's the team commander, he did um, Palmer Moon Dust. Dust, I think. Yes, yep. And then, oh, excuse me. April was, or Pask was ordering. Palmer Moon Dust, and I did Palmer Moon Dust on myself, because I can do two orders. Okay. And Pask. And it can be the same order. Yes. Um, then, uh, my tech priest here, here healed, demolisher, with two wounds. <laughs> Guess I'm tight. Man, these allergies. All right. <laughs> okay, so one more time, guys. The number of shots from each of these. On D6, he rolled a 6 for two of them and a 5 for the other. Yes. So let's go back over here. Yes. So, it'd be 5 to hit you. We're rolling any misses. Actually, that's better than your first one. Ooh, lucky me. That's actually a lot better than your first. <laughs> You're rolling. So two extra hits. 
and now Rooting on threes, we're rolling ones. Uh, no ones. So. Yep, that actually netted you more. Wow, lucky me. Uh, AP? One. AP minus one, but I'm in terrain, so AP is zero. Looks like. And I fail one of them. Oh, the assassin is still making things an additional. Yep. Yeah, I'm not going to do it. Okay, and this is damage too, right? And it's correct. All right, so I'm just going to take the guy off that's clinging to the edge for his life. And I'm going to set him in on the shelf for the moment. Then, I'm not done yet with High Squad, I'm going <laughs> to pop off an illustrator uh, for, the Canadian, for the Canadians. Uh, overlapping Fields of Fire. Plus one to hit or wound something. And one to hit rolls. Okay, so for that squad. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna see if I actually get that command point back or not. I do, so. Okay, so no more heavy motor fox in them. For the other team of three. Correct. Uh not, not No, as good. I'm not gonna re roll that one. That's kind of silly. So eh, not too many, but So I'll be going up. Hitting on a four. So we're rolling once because I'm Canadian. All right. Because you're hitting on plus one, right? Yes. Okay. Not wounding. And all wounds. So AP minus one. Okay, which is negated. Ooh. So that is actually more devastating than the other one. So I need to, because there are two damage, right? Yes. So that's another three there. That was my question now, real quick, before I forget. For blast weapons, it's five or more is minimum of three, right? Yes, yeah, so I you had a one. one, so roll an additional two dice real quick. Uh, one hit, two. one more wound. And... Nope. So four dead. Okay, so that will be... Half the squad. You need to eliminate more than half the squad in order to force them to have the minus one to combat attrition. Well, I'm not even done that against that squad because now my happy fun guardsmen are going to attack. Guardsmen attack? Yes, I know. Is that spooky? <laughs> uh, how many are left? Five. For any long term, you're tossing a frag round, blast. So, well. It blast doesn't matter when you're five guys. Oh, I thought it was five or something. No, it's six. Oh, what was the way? matches on six. All hits. One wound, no AP. Okay, and I'm going to take this one that ran low and have uh, it go high. Well, in that case, I'm going to do five. Excuse me, guys, I'm sorry about me being a sniffly. Taco, taco. Thank God for... Oh, wow. For being Canadian. Uh, let's get that one out of there, because it's a two, right? Yeah. And I'm still hitting on fives. And I'm re-rolling... Oh, shit. You know what? It's add one to hit. Yes. We already <laughs> did that, because it counteracts It's the... for the whole turn, though. Yeah. It's counteracting the... Okay. I, well, I screwed that up, but that doesn't really matter right now. It's still a lot of those guns. Um, yeah. That's so, cool. three wounds. Three wounds. All set. I tried. Okay, now... So it's a good have, amount of wounds for las guns. I'm going to have the Chimera here. It's going to shoot heavy sober, multi laser, and heavy bolter, and on them, and the Hunter Killer Rocket, and the him. Yay! So, first off, the Hunter Killer Rocket, and it'll be a five to hit him, because of shadows. No, no, remember, plus one to hit. I because got of your other part, but you still got it too anyway. Yeah. Anyway, um, multi laser. Wow. Okay. Look at that. All hits. Wait, multi laser? Yeah. Isn't that six shots? No. I thought it was more. No, anyway. just three. I wish it was more Fox. Uh, all wounds. Yep. No AP though. Yeah, just one takes a wound. Yep. Uh, could you please hand me a weird color die? Like a white dice? You racist bastard. 
There we go. Hey, hey, we sober now. Uh, one hit, two hits, my bad. And one wound. Boop, boom, boom. So that'll take him out because you're still shooting at this, right? Yep. So now that is under half. A heavy bolt hurt. Reroll at one. So one hit. One wound. AP minus one. One AP minus one. Womp, womp, womp. Two damage. Alright, so as long as it's not the just a car. And they're not even done yet. But wait, there's more. The Wiles guns from the um, Swift Weapon Squad? Because why not, right? Yeah. Here, I'll, I'll take this because I'll probably take a wound. Two hits. Uh, nothing. And wound. No. no. Oh, well, I tried. No, was still fun, though. Hey, I tried Storm Bolters against tanks. They did some wounds, so. Yeah. Okay, that fire, that fire, these lags fired. Um, now I'm going to shoot this commander right here, the gray one, into this lad right here. Are you sure you don't want to shoot the heavier weapons at it first? I'm going to shoot the Laz guns here. Laz gun? Okay. The Laz guns from the squad, and the grenade, and the. What's the toughness again? Six. Okay. Well, I was going to do the Terminators, rocket launcher and the grenade launcher into him. Okay, rocket and grenade. So rocket launcher be hitting you on a five up because I moved. It's a crack rocket. I missed. Crack grenade. Canadian misses in the way. Then the um, Lava guns. Wow. Canadians trained them. One wound. And AP is zero, right? Well, yeah. Good. I have tried. Um, so now I'm going to go and have the whole rabbit and shoot into him. Because that's the only target that he really has. Okay. So first off, um, oh, multi laser. Here, get yeah. that, and let's move that. Base. Yes, we have an entire section of the board that's just cut off and yeah. in a mess. Oh well, hate us, like us, I don't care. All picks. Three wounds. Three wounds. AP is... Zero. Well, there's a one. Better than nothing. And the damage is... One! So, uh, he's down to twelve. Well, I'm just going to say how many wounds he has left. Because I still have the heavy bolters next. Well, that's counting up, not down. Oh my god, okay, fine. He's got 12 remaining. Fine, happy? Yes. Ah, heavy bolter. It makes things a lot easier. Two picks. No wounds. Oh. Heavy silver. And? All hits. One wound. Just one? Yes. Uh, AP is? Uh, one. Minus one. So, uh, and that's coming from who again? He's more than 12 inches away, right? Yeah. So I will get uh, the cover, benefit of light cover, even though he's technically in the air. He still has a two up safe. Yep. Whee! Yay! Okay. Um, Try to rocket. some of the shine. Uh, there's a miss. Then I have the wild guns inside. And six is two wounds. No wounds. Nope. Oh well. Tried. Hey, I knocked off a moon. I'm happy about that. Right. Uh, then I'm going to shoot. You know what? Let's just get this stuff out of the way. This demolisher is going to shoot his main gun at the Terminators in the back. Oh, okay. Um, actually, no, I'm going to shoot. I have line of sight to those Terminators right there. Um, 
So, demolition cannon there. Then I'm going to shoot um, everything else. So, plasma cannons, um, plasma cannons, lava cannon, hunter killer rocket into him. Then the heavy sober right there. Does so, why not? Yeah. So, first off, heavy sober. Before I forget. Hit on threes. Fail. Uh, one wound. One wound at AP minus. Zero. Zero, and that was against the... Them. Them. Okay, so... Whoop! Oh, good. Okay. That's a five for those here. Can't see. Now for the Demolisher Cannon. Um, because it's a minimum of five, so it's a blast weapon. Alright, it's These a blast weapon. All, they, they blast weapons are six plus. Oh, okay, well in that case... Not uh, fives. Anyway, 2d3 fucks. And I can re-roll that because I do not like that. Because I'm them to dust. So four shocks. Not that bad. Um, two's to wound. One, two, three. Minus four AP. Minus four AP against Terminators. So. And that, let's see, they count as being in light cover even though they're in the open due to Tide of Shadows. So I would put me to a 1, but minus 4 puts me to a 5, which is the same as my invol anyway. So I'll probably make one of these. Oh, hey, actually, I actually make two. Okay. okay. And d6 damage. d6. Oh, uh, I don't know what. Do you want to spend the command point? You already got a command point uh, refunded this turn. Yeah, but do I really want a command point on a Terminator? I'm going to say no. Okay. Uh, hand me a weird colored dice, please. Oh, yellow. Let's see, who should I put this against? Let's put this against... Dave. Okay, uh, for plasma cannons, it's going to be an overcharge. Uh, this is from Pask, right? Right. Oh, two S shots. But Pound em Dust yes. is uh, what gives them rerolls for shots, right? Yes. Oh, actually, Polymer Dust is for turreted weapons, so it was only two fox. Okay. Oof. Oof. Reroll. Okay, so that saves you from an overcharge. Um, one wound. AP minus three. AP minus three. So, again, they count as... This was against two again? From... Okay. Him? Yeah. Uh, he has a four-up invul. Okay. Yep. So, let me put these dice over to you. Take this dice. Hopefully it rolls a four or higher. Yep. Okay. Laws cannon. I really do like that they gave him a better invul. Hicks. Wounds. I'm going to take a random dice from over here. And this was the same target, right? Yes. At AP. Minus three. Minus three. So again, four up invul. Yay. Damn you. Um, then I'm going to go and shoot regular Lemon Russ. Everything. That's a regular? Yes, that was the tank commander was right there. Oh, you meant regular as in not a commander. Correct. Okay. Um, he's going to shoot everything he has into him. Yep. So first off, I'm going to do the torture weapon. So 2d3. I like that. I think that would be fine. Average. Yeah. So four shocks. One hit. And... I'm going to use a command point and reroll that. It's a wound. Do I get that command point back? I do. Does he make his 4 up invul? Nope. And d6 damage. 4. So he has uh, 8. eight. Okay. Math! Um, side plasma cannons, overcharge, same target. These ones can... Ooh, that's okay. a good amount of shots. That's five fox. Two picks. A little bit under. Two wounds. Okay, and fours. Uh, one is failed, one is passed. So, two more points of damage are knocked off. Okay. Lava's cannon. Uh, misses. Then heavy stubber. 
two hex. One wound. Two up. Nah. All set. Hunt a killer rocket. Misses. And do you what else is there? Because that I'm was that was April slash Pask, right? No, that was some that was other, that was a regular guy. Oh, that was a regular. Yeah. Oh yes. So now I'm gonna shoot April. I'm gonna shoot the main gun at him. I'm gonna shoot the last cannon at him. And I'm gonna go for the heavy bolters. I'm gonna shoot everything at him because he has to die. I think we can agree on that, right? Well, I don't want him to die. I know that it's critical for you to have him to die. Yes. So, for the battle cannon, 10 fox. A good amount of shots, okay. I think I'm hitting on twos. Rolling ones. And these do not blow up on me. Yay, aren't you happy? We can say that again. Uh, three to wound. This may... Minus two. Minus two, so four up either way. Yep. Well, because you're... You know what? No. He counts as being in cover. So we got two up safe? Yeah. No, no. So two up goes to a one, but you're minus two, right? Or three? Yeah. Three. Minus three, so one goes to a two... Three. Nah, yeah, it's a four, by the way. Okay. Oops. Sorry about that. It was uh, six wounds, right? Yes. And just one goes through. Okay. Uh, D three points of na D three points of damage. So two points. I think he's under half. Okay. Now the heavy bolters. Oops, let me get that die out. Of those dice out of the way. All hits. And. Then we five wound, so two wounds at two up. Yeah, because of the train. But so okay. one is a failure, so that's another two points down. She should have two left. Yes. Last cannon. Nope. Uh, you already rerolled. Then um, the I uh, the heavy server, I the last cannon, I the heavy bolters. Okay. So basically, that was all my Lewin Rosses. Now, there is that stratagem for the Vindicare. I still got these two Camilos to shoot still. Okay. So, I'm going to shoot... I did not shoot the Hunter Killer Rocket on him. Yeah, you did. Oh, I did? Okay. Yep. Well, I'm going to shoot the Hunter Killer Rocket from this one, then. Makes sense. In a helm. I'm yeah. going to shoot everything in a helm. Everything. Okay. Miss. Multi laser. One hit. One wound. I'll grab that one. That was a two. Yay! Dang, heavy bolter. Two hits. And. Oh! No, 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 hold on. Wounds. One wound. Yep. Okay. All set. Um, and heavy silver. Two hits. Two. One wound. Yep. And. Heavy stubber, right? Yes, yeah, strength four, so we have five. Okay. Two up safe. Yeah, two up safe. Yeah. Whee! Aww. <laughs> then. You still have that one, I think. Yes. Do you want to? Yes. Um, Motor laser? Wait, uh, he has an killer, right? Yes. Do you want to shoot that first? Yes, or do you want to save it? Cause it's I'm going to save it just in case. Mortal laser biffs. Um, Stubber? Heavy bolter. A heavy bolter, okay. Roll that. No wounds. Heavy stub. One wound. One. All set. And the wild comes from the guys in the back. I mean, I'm going to be wounding you on like sixes. Yeah, but I could get lucky. Got to hit first. Oh, nope, never mind. Uh, Hunter Killer Rocket. 
Misses. And I got one unit left. One guy who can save the whole bloody day. The Vindicare Assassin. All he's got to do is hit, and then he can use the uh, stratagem. Or, also we can do call in an ale strike. You could. I'm going to call in an ale strike. On him. On a three up, you get a um, D3 mortal wounds, and on a... CP? No, this is from officer, um, this guy right here. So, oh, that's a character. Okay. Yes. So he's like what, an officer of the fleet? Yeah. Come in, reroll that. Um. Did you? I think I did because I rolled a five for some. Yeah. Okay, um, in that case, I'm going to shoot my Vindicator Assassin. So, so if he hits, you can use turbo penetration. I'm going to do turbo penetration. It hits, so it's one mortal wound. Yep, yeah, does because all you have to do is hit, and yes. then it's D three mortals. Yes. Well, one. It doesn't matter. Thing is, does he go boof? Yes. Wee. Ooh. So, let's see here. I'm gonna pause this, okay? Yeah. So, yeah, the Tower Panel trailer around from him saved the day and knocked him out. And unfortunately for me, in that particular case, apparently Dread Knights do not explode. And last but not least, before we move on, how about that uh, morale check for them? Let's uh, see. I need to roll D6. They lost seven guys. So anything but a one. Okay, so one guy is automatically going to run away! And then, because they are under half strength, uh, the other guys run away is on ones and twos. Another guy. Run away! Yeah, I like that. That was... Still, I thought basically, the only thing I really killed that turn was a Dread Knight. And almost a squad of Callisons. That was kind of sad. Oh, what is and they shall know no fear. I forgot what the heck that is. Should I cut this? Yeah. Okay. Who's reference? Cut. <laughs>